What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. Let's cover some more keys. So I have my second Audi key here, just probably like a Volkswagen key too, key fob, remote, a whole, the whole setup in there. And I picked this up, it's a key shell. And what is interesting about this is it's silver. And what it's also interesting, it's like a full on cover. And I'm gonna show it to you here. Let's just pull everything out, wow. Comes with a lot of stuff, which is kind of surprising given the low price point on this. Comes with the little key ring here, little D ring, metal, all metal hardware. It's actually kind of heavy. And then we have like this braided nylon loop on it. Look at that. So didn't expect that. And we also have a little screwdriver here, which actually is could be very useful for watch repairs and other small electronics. So I'm probably gonna hold on to this, but it sounds like I might need it for this. I don't know. Um so here is the key cover itself. And what was interesting to me about this when I was checking out in the pictures is it seemed like it was going to be a nice tight, kind of almost glove-like fit. But more important than that were the buttons right here. And let me show you why. You can see here, this is a, the key fob that gets used most often. And while two of the buttons are completely marked uh, with the original paint, the lock button up here is not very well marked. And so sometimes when I'm looking down on it, you, I'll know that this is the lock button, but uh, you know, sometimes I'm double checking. I'm like, where is it? Oh, it's up here. So what I really liked about this is that it's a full fob protector. It covers the whole thing. And the button icons are back. Now, they're not exact facsimiles of that, but that's all right. And, you know, even the, the little bump here where you're looking for that lock button kind of by touch is molded in here too. That being said, if you look at this thing, it's very nice. It's kind of got this chrome finish and it's black and, uh, I will tell you here, you're gonna lose the access to the panic button. I don't know, you might be able to hit it through that. But, and I say that because it's a little squishy. I think they call this TPU. It's not super thick. It's probably a millimeter, millimeter and a half thick. So it does have a little squishiness, but it's not super flexible, right? It's not like the a silicone you know, skin that's just like really floppy. So all we're gonna do here is I think you just kinda massage it into the case and try to do this as quickly as possible so it doesn't stretch out this, <coughs> the cover as much or as little as possible. So there we go, got it on, okay. Now, because this is a soft case at some level and not a hard case, you can't quite expect the same type of tight fit that you would on a hard case. And you can see here, uh, what I'd prefer is it to, I don't know, I don't know if I can get it any further down. Um, I'm gonna, I think that's about as good as it's going to get. See, it doesn't quite hug that. You can see how we have a little kick down here. So I feel like it should be a little bit more over, but it works pretty well. But you still have access to the button here to deploy your key. Uh, I don't know that I can get to the panic button. I don't want to press it because it's going to set off everything. We have a cutout right here of the Audi logo. So if this panic button is something you use a lot, keep that in mind. The, the Chrome is kind of a nice match to the chrome loop right there. But now, uh, as opposed to my old key, now I actually have all the button icons back. And even the, the nip on this one so that I can feel it by touch. But now I can look at it and it looks like a brand new key and it's very shiny and looks good. And this one now will turn into my spare key. But even that, uh, now it looks pretty good. Maybe I should just keep using this one. This has been pretty reliable. So check it out. Whether you want to pick this one up or another key cover, maybe it'll something like this one, uh, I'll put it a little link to it in the description. Dress up your key, make it a little more stylish, give it a new life. Peter Brown Panda, out.